Jeffrey R. Holland says in an LDS Temple open house video, quote, I don't know how to speak of heaven in the traditional, lovely, paradisiacal beauty that we speak of heaven. I wouldn't know how to speak of heaven without my wife, my children. It would not be heaven for me. Let me contrast this with a story. When my, when my wife and I moved to Orem, we lived in a basement apartment, and the host invited the, a, a BYU professor in the local ward to come over. And I asked him about Joseph Smith's sexual relationships with his, some of his plural wives, and he agreed to it, that it happened. And then he looked at my wife at one point, and he said, as she is, he's out right here, Stacy. He looked at my wife, and he said, don't you want to be married to your husband forever? <laughs> and she said, no. <laughs> I won't need to be. I will, I will be with Christ. And I wanted to kiss her. <laughs> I knew exactly what she meant. My wife doesn't depend on me for her eternal happiness in Christ. Neither do I her. We can both say together to Christ in Psalm 73, whom am I in heaven but you? And there is nothing on earth that I desire besides you. My wife and I can say forever together with David in Psalm 16, you are my Lord and I have no good apart from you. As for the saints in the land, they are the excellent ones in whom is all my delight. In your presence is fullness of joy. At your right hand are pleasures forevermore. My wife and I forever can say with David in Psalm 23 to Christ, surely goodness and mercy will follow me all the days of my life and I shall dwell in the house of the Lord forever.